But John Hunter Nemechek, I tell you, just a fantastic job, right? He had a fast car, but he controlled the race. They did the details the way they needed to. That's what helped them do that, right? There's other cars that could compete with the speed of the 20, but they executed the race on restarts, on pit road, and controlled it. And that's and now he just set the whole thing on fire. Oh. I get out. I get out on that one. That's big fire. I think that might be the mud flaps. Oh, no. It's really cool looking, but maybe not the safest, but this that's okay. Reminds me of Zane Smith after the Craftsman Truck Series race at Coda. I mean, the, the racetrack is on fire over there. It's, it's, this it, is like back to the future. It looks, on fire. Say, it looks like there's a DeLorean over there. Could we get the AMR right, safety team on, to back. victory lane? Come on back. He needs to get out. Excessive celebration. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's, it's cliche to say that John Hunter Nemechek was on fire tonight, but literally yeah. John Hunter Nemechek on fire at Martinsville. Wins the race, gets the grandfather clock, and oh yeah, he's also your victor in the dash for cash. Give him $100,000.